Okay, it's getting there. I think probably one more day tomorrow and this is done and should be ready to make a mold. He uh, has ears because, uh, I don't think we ever saw the ears, but you know, I think the mask should have them. If they'll be under the hair, they'll just be nice to have them there. So all the masks I've done so far do have ears, so I thought this one should. We have already a mold for uh, foam rubber prosthetics for the chimp that are on my life mask. And they were very successfully made quite some time ago. Uh, I was selling them in foam rubber. But what I'm gonna do now is offer them in polyurethane foam, self-skinning foam. These will uh, uh, last longer you'd be more uh, reusable the blender edges will be about the same not quite but plenty good to do cosplay and i'm going to turn this around this way um aim the camera at me and show you basically you know oh that smell oh that takes me back but they fit very well and these are about i think these were made about um, these were made about, God, what was it, 2014? And the rubber's still really, really good. Of course, it's been uh, under a plastic bag for years, um, but there's very little um, rotting going on, none at all, in fact. However, the polyurethane will far outlast it, and you can reuse it. So this is what's coming next, will be the prosthetics uh, chimp orangutan and gorilla now this is just a basic paint job on here they'll be much better painted uh, when you get yours and I'll have pictures of that because I'm going to run these in polyfoam probably next week